What's up guys, it's Burr back here, and we're back into some mods to play the Spire. Last time, we played, if I can click the right keys, as the Jester, and we were so close um, to finishing uh, in, in the first attempt. Um, however, we didn't, so we are going to embark again. Um, well, we're like right here in the beginning, and we're just going through this stuff, uh, picking our rewards from Niao. I did want to thank Aaron, who was on, I think it was... Uh, not the last episode, but the episode before that, probably, I think it's 43, um, Slay the Spire modded 43. Um, the last one with the chef, um, I'm not sure if they are the modder, but they, uh, actually we can go, wait, let's go back, um, and look at the name. But, if they were the person who made the mod, the chef, thank you, they commented asking, um, about the character and some of, uh, my opinions, which I think I answered, but I was going to go through them. Again, why we are right here at the beginning. Oh, I don't have the chef, so I can't look. <laughs> uh, continue. Um, but, yeah. Uh, he was asked, saying that there needs to be a nerf to the cookie jar. Uh, agreed. Um, it was very fun, though, and I very much enjoyed him. I might have to try him again in the future. Um, my suggestion was to try change it to similar to how... Um, actually, similar to how the Jester's Cap. Do it, it only works so many times uh, per turn. So if it uh, proc like the first like two times you used hunger, or once per turn, um, like the first time an enemy is hungry per turn, deal that damage. It'd still be pretty good, but wouldn't be able to like continuously do that damage over the course of the turn. Anyway, um, every time you shuffle, you draw a card, random rare. Oh, this is obtain a curse was, or lose your starting god. Let's obtain the curse and get a rare relic. Ginger can no longer become weak. Not. The best, not the worst. Okay, so I think, thinking about it this time, we're going to have a harder time than we did last time. Um, for the simple fact of, oh, there's a three leap path, but it is rough. I think we're going to take two, taking this like middle left path. Um, go up, we can get that early shop uh, just to give us a little power to hit those elites. And there's a fair few question marks. I think I'll go this way. We'll go that way. Um, but without the silent cards that we had last time, I think we're going to have a much harder uh, time this time. Uh, permanently add a copy of this card to your deck. Gain five gold at the end of each comic for every greed in your deck. Every time you play it. It's ethereal. Um, hmm. I think I'll play it a couple times. Uh, only for the fact that we can... Uh, benefit from having more cards to discard from like sickle and we recycle them uh so this card this character is a discard heavy character so it actually doesn't hurt too much uh, i think i'll take one instead of the whole six okay oh, la, la. can i kill them here um if we draw a strike we can't <laughs> but we got to get the eight block here so taking one more another greed uh, I think the downside to playing the greeds though is that I'm never going to be able to remove them very efficiently. Uh, one frail. Upgrade a card in your hand. Uh, flame dance. Can you tell me whenever you, uh, you are attacked this turn, deal 6 damage back. What's the upgrade? Is it upgrade to 1? Then 10 damage back. That's pretty solid. I mean, uh, I, I like it more than anything else here. Okay. And there's our greed. Uh,. We'll flame dance here to get that 10 block and then we'll strike one of these two. Green does not hurt us here. And the extra 10 gold, they're ethereal, so like the first shuffle is pretty bad, but as long as I can get them into my hand, um, I'm pretty set. I don't want to take any damage here. We'll uh, hold off. Wait, let me read the greed again, actually. Now that I'm thinking about it, is it? I think I have for every greed in your deck. Huh. I don't know. If it means 10 extra, or if they have to be not exhausted. Like, did I get 14? Huh, I can't really tell. Because if that's how it works, it is definitely not as good. I had a prank. Card receipt, deal it damage, place this card with hide. How much is it? It's 11, right? If you upgrade it? Yeah, we looked at this last time. I think it's pretty good. I mean, just 11 damage or 11 block for one. We'll take it. All right, spoils. Let's go, and we're going to go right through here. 
Flame Dance, good to have right here. Um, recycle, throw that back, get the sickle, throw these two back. Oh, just throw one of the two. And pretty good. Not too terribly bad. Okay, uh, hide the eight block. I'm gonna try this time to keep the greeds in the deck, uh, but I don't know if I'll be able to do so. To see if it actually gives us 10 on top of that. That'll kind of determine how we want to do this. I really would like to have killed them there, but I can't. But we should still have one greed. I don't think we'll exhaust it this time. Uh, yes, well, I'll at least have one. Strike them. Now, is it five on top? No. I don't think they're working the way I would expect. Uh, draw a card for each card, discard this turn. Eh. Oblivion Strike was really good. Um, I think we'll take it, because we still are discarding. We don't really have a, like, a set idea so far. Can we upgrade any number of times? Uh, again, I'm not, like, excited. I could just take membership card, which would just be good the rest of the run. I'll take that. Yeah, everything's half price now. And that'll be good later. It doesn't give us that power we wanted. Um, lose flame dance, obtain a relic. Well, 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 well. Um, sure. Uh, oh, pfft. Tin flute is not what we wanted. There's so many other relics that it could have been. Um, and that was not one of them. Bad hand. Exhaust some of the greeds out. Which, again, I don't think are working. <laughs> oh, and we hit the stinking oblivion strike. Um, I guess I should play hide just to get it into damage. And then we'll dodge to see. Yeah, no. Not worth it. He's going to wake up this turn, after this turn. Okay, I guess this is the best it's going to be. Uh, strike. Sickle. Strike. Dodge. And we got into another strike. Yeah, this this is not going to be very good. Not good at all. Alright, play that. Play the strike. Play the oblivion strike. Uh, we should have played that over the normal strike, I think. Just in terms of damage. This, I don't know if one is one of the ones we can uh, necessarily get out of. Oh, oblivion strike's really good here, though. I'm going to front some more damage here. Ugh, gross. And, of course, the turn we want to have a halfway decent damage hand, we don't. 49. Eh, it's going to be close. Yeah, that's some really good turns now that we're, especially since we're weak now. Strike. Strike. Another 18 for another 5 damage. I think so. It's, it's hard to say when you get in, like, these oppressive battles. The Log of Ulan is one of those ones that are so hard to... Like, he scales way quicker than you. I really need this Oblivion Strike. Oh, you got to get it. Okay. And it dropped the hide, of course. Oh, Oblivion Strike came back, though. Yeah, let's get 12 in there. Okay, he's down to 15. We're going to be one more attack. But I think he goes, yeah, he cycles in the damage this time to reduce our damage. Okay, we got him, I think. Next turn, we'll get him. <laughs> oh, it's going to take two of them, though. All right, we got it, though. We got it. Um... I want to play the normal strike first, and the sickle does one damage. Whew. Down to eight. Cunning Disguise. Uh, future card. We'll have one from a different character. Oh, you shouldn't have. The Silent. <laughs> Definitely the Silent. Um, seven bucks next turn. No. Four plated armor, but it's only once. If, what is upgrade to? Five plated armor for one. Draw a card at the start of your next turn. It's good. I'll take it. It's just like, depending on the enemy, it could be not as good. Okay, and we'll get a rest before this elite. So, we'll go with that. We kind of actually do want the fight. Oh, another, like, disgustingly gross turn. All right, we have eight. We'll go up to 12. And they're still hitting us so hard. Okay, fully block. And we still didn't block enough, so we're going to lose one of our plated armor. That's the disadvantage. If it was metallicized, it'd be much better. Um, I kind of want to hit the slime. All right, we kept the Oblivion Strike, which is the one I wanted. Um, do I keep the, the armor or get him five more damage? I think this is going to be a longer fight, so we'll do that. Okay, bellowing. And it's my 14 here. Disgusting. All right, do that. Oh, got Seek, not the one we want. 13. All right, we're over that. Seek will do good damage back here. And then I'll turn back to hide. 
don't want to play the greeds because they are not working the way I'd expect them to. Immune to weak, very good. Um, I can't kill. I got to double defend. I really don't want to take any more damage. And then Oblivion Strike does more. We'll kill the slime in the back, so he'll stop harassing us. And now we just got to lay the damage on. Um, strike, strike, Oblivion Strike. All right, so hopefully as long as he's not, like we have some decent draws, we should be, okay. Drop Sickle for defense, 13 defense, strike. Blocked it, but it is what it is. He is gonna continue gaining damage though, so we really need to lay on the damage. The jaw worms scale pretty quickly. It's not as quick as the cultists, because they have to, like, it's just not a return. But it can be pretty devastating. Oh, Oblivion Strike. Does that, can I kill him if I really tried? We're going to try for it. Three, if we get in a strike. And we didn't. We got to defend. Can I uh, choose a card in your discard pile and return it to your and cost heroes? Worth it. Um, Oblivion Strike. Yep. I just don't want to take any damage. Actually, that might have killed me if not. Duplication Potion. Pretty good. Inspiration. Playable. Uh, unplayable. Gain out one energy when drawn. Ooh, also another swiftness, pretty good. But inspiration does upgrade to two energy. Uh, no, when uh, oh, you disc could discard it, so it's into your discard pile faster. I don't know the benefit of that, because you just want to draw on and then it immediately discards and you draw another card. Actually, that's pretty good. So it just give you a free energy and then discard itself, so you don't have to worry about, and then you get another draw. Well, this is not a good turn. Uh, and we dropped the freaking Okay, play drama though. That gets us enough. And then the double greed. Waste of some energy and some inspiration. Oh, gosh. Um, hide. Defend. Strike. Sickle. I guess I should have sickled first since they were both strikes anyway. In case I got the Oblivion strike. Technically, um, but that's fine. Defend. Um, we're just gonna play out all the cards, except one, which would be the strike. Okay, not bad. Plate armor is kind of nice. Um, it doesn't scale as fast as I would like. And oh, we got the seek. As I say, of course we dropped the uh, the only attack, but we have one more. Was worried for nothing. Okay, uh, we should be able to just kill him. And it hits the card I want. Didn't want it to. However, we still have more strikes. Um, Swift Potion could save us in a pinch. Arrhythmia, I still kind of like, but I still think it'll get us killed. Um, whenever you shuffle your draw pile, I think our deck's too thick. I'll take another hide and seek. I'm kind of liking it. 21, I thought to whenever you use a potion, gain 5 HP. Not very good. Um, we're going to rest here. I still want to take out this elite. Um, we've got a pretty good amount of relics. It's just the last three have been kind of crappy. Oh, this is a bit long one. Okay. Swiftness. Um, only take a nine. So let's go ahead and hit one of them. Okay. Cool. Actually, really good. Uh, we hit that. We're going to hit the back one as our first target. All right. I don't think the plated long armor will be long for this world. However, I'm going to try to keep it if we can. Um, if I double defend... No, actually, wait. Uh, 12. Yeah, I got I to gotta double to keep the plated armor. That's fine. I only got one strike. Oh, I, I couldn't play any strikes. I'm still kind of fine with that. Okay, we'll dodge once. That gets it. And then we can strike the back. Once we get it down to two, it'll be a pretty fair like back and forth, I think. And we actually might be able to do that here. Not with that hand, we won't. Um... Actually, we can. Uh, we're still going to take damage. But we'll get rid of the dazes. Take five, but now it's down to two. I think I prefer this fight to the, to the gremlin mob fight. What sucks is now we have to play two defends. This time it doesn't matter. Um, to continue getting the benefit of keeping the plated armor. That's kind of dumb. I mean, I could take the dex potion just so we don't have to. All right, drop that. The daisies are really clogging up our hands. Two more daisies. Yep, like this one. Sucks. 
Okay. Um, seek, strike, sickle, defend. Yep. See, we only get eight. Progressively worse every time. Okay, hit him. Double defend. We'll get him next turn so we won't have to worry about his attack. Assuming we don't draw all dazes. Close enough to drawing all dazes. Only defensive cards. Okay, luckily it's only one. Seriously. Our hands are just poo. This, that's one thing. Like, we're discarding and drawing, which is great. However, we're putting the dazes back in the deck. Okay. Keep cutting them out. It's like we're getting rid of two every time. Um, strike, dodge. Okay. Sickle. Strike. Not bad. We're, we're not taking more damage. I did not look who are final bosses. So I don't know if the Hexaghost or the damage is fine and we should be worried about it. Okay. Another one. Unceasing top. Whenever you have no cards in hand or turn, uh, draw the card. Very good. I don't know if we'll ever get to no cards in hand. But if we can, it'd be really good. Um, elusive 12 damage. Butter knife. I kind of... Well, draw a card, discard a card. Uh, what cards? I guess... If we continue building into the discard, which is what we're kind of doing, that's going to be the best choice. Approach. Credit card. Choose one of ten. Max HP. I think I'd rather upgrade. We're kind of behind the curve on upgrade. Twelve damage here. I thought I was draw one, discard one. Um, recycle. No. I need more. Recycle two here is pretty nice, but I don't think it's ready yet. I think Oblivion Strike will be the hit. Just because it's going to be our source of damage, I think. I'm going to smith again. Uh, I think I'll go inspiration. And it's slime, so I don't really know. Lose HP for the gold, or lose 36 gold. We'll lose the HP, and we'll, then we'll just rest. So we'll get 21 back. That's not too bad. I think we can do it with 32. We're not like... This is like an uphill battle for damage, but I don't think we're too under damage. And I, I can I can really cheat out a good amount of damage if I need to. Um, the hides in this turn kind of suck. Sickle, drop that. Dagger throw, drop that. Actually pretty good. Hit him twice. Still continuing. If I have to, I'll, I'll really want to lay on the damage if I can get like a duplication, something or another. Okay. Strike, dodge, 35 here. Oh, of course we get swiftness. Um, I need 16 damage, so let's draw three cards. Not bad. Okay. So that's 12. I'd have to duplication potion to really get through it. Uh, can I dodge out of it? Okay. So that'd be eight. I can get up to 16. I'm not going to die, but I really just don't want to. But they're going to be such a high split. Let's not. Okay. Um... Trying to think of the best way to do this. Dodge out of it. Defend. Okay. We're going to take 15. But it's such a high split value. It's not. I don't think it's as worth it. Because now we can really hit him here. Oblivion strike. Hit him there. Oh, I should have doubled that, honestly. And then hit him again. So down to 50. For the two splits. Not bad. Oh, 16. Ew. That's kind of gross. We'll hide here. Sickle him. Drop something. Inspiration, not bad. We can actually play out all these slimes. Okay, didn't take anything. I'm pretty okay with that. Uh, another hide. We're going to dodge. Oblivion Strike. There we go. So if we really lay into him next turn, we should be good to split them out a decent number. Okay, they're both attacking. Not what I want to see. Um, Can I kill him if I really wanted to? I think I could. Duplication. Get some more HP back. Dagger throw. We're going to hit him twice. Discard the defend. I'm kind of hoping to draw into... Okay. Discard the other defend. Okay. Into some more damage. He's splitting. Let's split him even lower. And then we'll defend for one. Only three. <laughs> Plus... Oh, because we're frail. We got six. So we took ten. 
But these, very manageable. As in, like, managed. Oh, and Oblivion Strike him. Oh, 10 from you. Don't like that. Can I get a strike? Seek, 8 damage, done. Good, I'm happy with that. We did use two potions to do this, but I think we are good. Um, strike. Let's play, I'm at the dodge. Get the slime back. Another strike's pretty good. Oh, I interrupted him. Whoops, I should have waited until next turn. Not too terribly bad. Okay, so 28, we can block. Oh, we're, we're already blocked. So I don't need to worry about that. So let's get some damage. I'm thinking dagger throw, drop the defend, and we'll do that. So another frail, which kind of, we're still frail, which kind of sucks. But oblivion strike, oh, we have no way to throw. We'll get the nine damage on him and then get off the slime since it doesn't really matter. Try to unclog our hand. Strike, strike, sickle, dagger throw, done. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Gamblers proved really good because we were discarding stuff. Uh, if you are or weak, eh. If fatal, obtain a random potion. Eh. Double skill play next this turn twice. We don't have any skills or plan though. I mean, we could get a bunch of artifact. Well, I can't because I don't have it yet, but that's like the only thing. Frustration, we're never frail, vulnerable, or weak. I guess I'll take, how much does it come? 22? We'll take boil down. Potions are good, so. Get away. Uh, you can either gain nor lose. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. I think I'd just rather take the curse key. That's fine. I can remove curses if I need to. Okay, elite. Uh, looks like two elite, yeah. At most. Uh, question marks, elite here. Shop there, that's kind of nice. We'll start there. Kind of want to go to the shop, this is to be a membership card. Take advantage of that. Gross turn. Damage, damage. I just said I want my money. I also want to start removing the greeds. They've been very unhelpful. Alright, we have five energy this turn. So hide. Strike. I can't kill you, can I? No. Um, defend. I might as well hit you, though. Yep. I do like that it doesn't exhaust. It is two, but we have the energy to play two cost cards. So um, Drop the defend. Um, Oblivion Strike, this one. Defend, defend. So we're good there. I think this looter will get away unless I can really hit him really hard. Yeah, he's bouncing. Um, I could get a potion. Could I kill them is the question. It would have to be like the best hand. We'll try it though. Because he's defending still. So I don't technically have to. Oh, I'm so close. I could shoot for it. I need a, like the best pool. I don't want to take my money. Come on. There we go. Not getting out of here. And then just a good hand will kill him too. The seven damage. Nine. That was a bad. Okay. Illness was good. Another dagger throw would be really good. But this is already up. the upgraded bouncing knife. I think is even better. Um, get the curse of shame. 85 gold. Uh, uh, I don't want the fur on this, so we'll take this. And that's a coup. Every 10 attacks, we gain an energy. Not, we got, we're getting some energy stuff, which I'm kind of liking. I sight. Uh, I, I Icosahedron. I, I didn't uh, butcher it as much this time. Okay. What do we got here? Mud balls, some blocks, next turn, anticipation, no. Um, question card, I liked. I like it a lot, actually. That, I'm gonna start removing the greeds. They're just dead draws. I could Apotheosis, too. That's kind of nice. Uh, one one cost, too, eventually. Yeah, let's go with that. We cycle through our deck pretty quickly, so I'm not, like, too, like, against that idea. All right. 
I mean, it, we have the energy to play them out. Oh, let's hit this. 13, three artifacting. Cool. Not unuseful. Not very useful either, but I don't have that much of a problem with it. Suffer. Oh, I didn't though. Uh, dagger throw. Drop to defend. Oblivion strike. Sickle for one. Cause well, yeah. Cause then I can play the apotheosis if I get it. I didn't. Dodge. Now I got it. <laughs> okay, can't be weakened. Thank you. Um, seek. Dagger throw. Play ten attacks. There's the strike. I'm gonna actually drop the inspiration because we already took advantage. Okay, Apotheosis. Hide now. And then the strike. I could have killed him. However, we're taking one damage. I will accept the one damage for this fight. Not bad. We're, we're getting there. Piercing well. Taunt. Apply three vulnerable to an enemy. Gain one vulnerable. If you are weak, until again. Nope. And draw three. And gain three energy and draw three energy next turn. None of these are great. I'm not... Not excited for this, so we're gonna skip them. Okay, Taskmaster. Here's gonna be the real uh, test of like how we're doing. That slaver took some damage, damage as it would be. Actually, I think I should have started with the one in the back. He's the one who will uh, net me. Ooh, ouch. I'm actually gonna go ahead and break this. 18 damage, you're done. And I get a potion. Power potion. I like that it get you can just continuously cycle through potions. Start your turn. Gain negative two to off. Negative two three. Negative two to three strength. What? And they. That is not what I want to see. Cool idea. Not what I want. <laughs> um, ten damage or seven block. Uh, yeah. I was like, I don't know what I want here. Let's see. 20. Natural 20. I think it stays like that now. We just get an extra energy now. That's pretty cool. I don't feel like I get that very much. This. Swiftness. Um, just go ahead and sickle there. Ooh, a dodge and a strike. Uh, I'm not... I don't have any blocks, so... That'll be good. I shouldn't have hit the intern button so quickly. I could have got a zero cost. I don't know what it would have been, but... Um, Oblivion strike. You're hurt. You're hurt again. Drop the wound. I'm liking what we got going here. You're done. Uh, and I can play out the whole hand. Not bad. Oh, I had unceasing top two. Boil down. It does 22, so we're going to kill you with that. Extra potions. Pretty nice. I like that it doesn't exhaust. That makes it kind of a little bit more worth it to me. Now, there you go. At the start of your turn game, one plate armor is a good one. It does. I like it. Now, I'm on board for that. Alright, we're going up to that Emerald Delete. So, Smith, I want to upgrade Apotheosis. Thank you. Now we just gotta cycle to it. Find some potions. Sure. Swift Potion. The vulnerability is good, but I'd rather have another Dex. Yeah, we'll do that. I actually should have dropped the skill one, but that's fine. Uh, this box here. We'll get a Curse and Pantogram. That's really nice. We won't have to rest before bosses. It's underrated. It doesn't, like, necessarily help you power through, like, power up. However, it's not bad. Okay, I definitely want to keep this boy from filling my deck with dazes if I can help it. And I did. And then we'll draw a card that we can't play. Fine. If there's Apotheosis, then I'll be mad. <laughs> uh, apotheosis, Momentum, Swiftness. Not bad. Oh, I can and I can still play this. Boil down. The greeds are eating up a little bit of my hands, which I hate. Sloth, oh, from the curse we just picked up. That's fine, though. Um, strike, sickle, drop both those. Defend, burning knife. Okay. One energy, why do I have one energy? What is going on? Momentum. No, no. I don't know why I only have one energy. Huh. Something feels bad. Yeah. What is... 
Now we have two energy. Three. Which we should have much more. Ow. Yeah, I, I'm so confused. Uh, okay. That was a weird fight. I gave fashion block in one week. Not bad. Uh, we'll do it. The weakness kind of sucks, but it's fine. Now I don't know if I want to go further. Yeah, we should have five. Like, look at that. Um, do that. Oh, we lost the card I want to play. But that's fine. I'd rather play it after the apotheosis. So strike, swiftness. We're not taking any damage, so I don't want to take the weak. Okay. Hide, strike, defend, knife. Ouch. I'd rather draw some cards. Thank you. Um, drop the inspiration. That's fine. I can't play the apotheosis, but that's okay. I'm taking less damage here, which is what I wanted. Man, I forget how much damage this guy does. Okay. Living strike. Yeah, something's going on weird here. 21. I'm at 9. I'll still be alive, but yeah, this is not... This is I'm only going to have one energy, but I should have five. Huh. Uh, I'm unsure what I want to do here. Drop the defend. Strike him. Um, seek him. Erg. What can I get here? Forever monster. Uh, skip these. Now there's what I want. Mostly the healing. There are two now. I don't. There has to be. Yeah, lose all my skill. Oh, it's the sloth that's killing me. Okay, I can kill him here, though. That's bad. <laughs> Very bad. Okay. Um, another hide and seek would be good. There's treat me really well. Uh, yes. I don't know. Discarding. Well, I don't have enough discard yet. We'll take another hide and seek. Like, I want a shot before this dude. Grow. Hmm. Momentum would be good to go ahead and have upgraded. Because I thought it was like something of a momentum. Uh, I don't need another curse. Upgrade a card in my deck. Even though we're upgrading it all eventually. I want to upgrade now. Because yeah, it's not gonna help us. And I don't I don't want the pain. Okay. And we're gonna have yeah, we're gonna have to rest after this. Dodge. It's fine. Um sickle. Let's see if we have the tricky dodge left. Okay. Sloth. Son of a gun. Okay. Play that. Play that. Apotheosis. Might as well get as much out as we can. I almost forgot about the unceasing top. All right, yeah, we have one this turn. Gosh dang, it, two energy to play with. I need just like straight up block. And yeah, I'm gonna have to break this. Two energy, gave us more hit points. Swiftness is a block. Uh, start, okay, 18 and nine is 27. We get five, so we'll be up to 22. Yeah, we've lost. Because of opening that chest. Because I could dagger throw. Which is fine. I get the hide. Cannot play it. None of my relics help me. That's that's all she wrote. Dang. That does suck. Because, yeah. We were doing very well. Another chance where we got the uh, silent cards. They just fit so good um, with this character. Like, as just like an added discard engine. Ah, disguise was great. Terrible. Not bad at the end. I guess, like, no, I drank all my potions. We even had the D20, the key. We had so much energy and slothful. Just cut it out. Oh, well. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, you can hit that like button. Subscribe if you want to see more. Um, I'm still going to be taking suggestions for other modded characters to play or other mods just to try and slay the spire 
Um, I'm going through characters right now, but um, later on I'll probably diversify again um, before probably generating a pack of my favorite stuff. Um, or just a set. Pack is the, more the Minecraft term. But hope you enjoyed. Thanks, guys. Bye. Thank you.